What an effective idea. Leave it to the privileged elite to find a way to make their lives even easier. What? Anyone can post a job request? Why didn't you say anything sooner? I guarantee you won't find these prices anywhere else. Don't go too far ahead. 
It could be dangerous. Fine. Well done. We've been expecting you. We're on a roll, lady. We should get out there and grab the last way marker. It's not that easy. Something's preventing entry into fractured dimensions. We think it's the spirit Maxwell. <gasps> the CEO will bring you up to speed on all the details in his office. Luger, hey! This is no time for small talk, you guys! All you need to know is Maxwell's stopping us from getting the last way marker. Wait, Maxwell? Things are getting interesting. It would seem I need to have a chat with these spurious overseers of yours. We're coming with you. Fine, just hurry up! Is it wise to bring along an entourage like this? With the foreign king and a great spirit? It's probably not wise, but I doubt we'd be able to stop them. Why, Luger, you're late. I believe you have something to tell us, Mr. Bacor. Yes, something about Maxwell. My goodness, no one said you brought a VIP. Please pardon the intrusion. I am the king of Riza Maxia. Call me Gaius. It's a pleasure, Highness. Beasley Bakur, CEO of the Spirius Corporation. Are you certain you're safe here? What, with the peace accord ratification ceremony fast approaching? Fear not. He is under my protection. Who's she? Trusted. Oh, I'm just a humble spirit. Don't mind me. You're a spirit. I see. What happened? We've detected the fractured dimension that contains the final way marker of Canaan. Unfortunately, there's an obstacle somewhere within the dimensional abyss that's blocking all attempts at entry. I wonder if there's a way to circumvent it. We tried to force our way through, but were ever so rudely evicted. By the power of the Four Great Spirits. The power of the Four? Mila! Indeed. Mila Maxwell herself stands between us and the final way marker. It was Kronos who put her there. But escaping from the Abyss should be child's play if she has the Four with her. Perhaps it's not a matter of wanting to return, but of being unable. Regardless, the final way marker is beyond our reach until something is done about Mila Maxwell. I would like to request the help of Riza Maxia with this situation. Very well. We'll look for a solution on our end, too. The solution is clear, isn't it? Hey, where are you going? Yes, Rowan, what is it? El and Mila are still somewhere in the city. Let's go find them. get it, don't you?
Don't play dumb and make me say it. I know you're not that heartless. <laughs> you think the reason our Mila can't return is because... Of me. No maybes about it. How do you know? Because two identical things can't coexist in the Prime Dimension. This world's not big enough for two Milas. Yours can't return until I'm gone. Mila, wait! The way to bring her back into her rightful dimension is obvious. You have to kill me. <gasps> what? Ixnay in front of the kid, yeah? No point hiding it. It's the truth. Yeah, well, it's gonna have to wait. Gaius just called. He got word that Exodus is plotting a whopper of an attack. Don't tell me they're targeting the peace accord ceremony. He wants our help nipping this thing in the bud, so to speak. What do you say? <sighs> Let's go. We'd appreciate it. You coming too? All right. Time to hurry then. Gaius is already on his way to where they're holding the ceremony in Marksburg. <laughs> I knew it all along. It's me. Put me in touch with those Exodus lowlifes, would you? Exodus just doesn't give up, do they? What sort of horrible scheme have they hatched this time? You think that's true? No two of the same thing can simultaneously exist in the Prime Dimension? There's no definitive proof either way. True. Luger, what happened at the Upsilla Ruins? Well, Rolo met another Rolo, and the Rolo with the weird voice disappeared. It was like our Rolo just replaced him. Well, there you have it. The other Mila entered the Prime Dimension, while our Mila was trapped in the Dimensional Abyss. So she could be the cork in the bottle that's stopping our Mila from getting back in. It all adds up. So if we return the other Mila to her fractured dimension... But we already destroyed her dimension. And besides, once we enter a fractured dimension, we can't get back without destroying it. Why does it have to be like this? Uh, the way Rolo disappeared... I feel like I've seen it before. You're here. What's happening? Based on our documents, we're rounding up Exodus agents who've slipped into the city. Quietly, of course. Yeah, it'd be bad news if the public found out. If people found out, you could just erase them from history. That's your specialty, right? Mila, take it easy. There a problem? I'm sure it's nothing to you. You destroy whole worlds. Taking me out is trivial. <laughs> Taking out Maxwell? Everybody stop fighting! The ceremony is about to get started. We've captured most of the Exodus members in the city. Now we just need to guard against attacks from without. Damn it all! They totally used <sighs> me! Oh, sorry about that, Kitty. Marcus? Huh? Uh, Alvin! Hold up! He a friend of yours? Uh-huh. From back when I ran with Exodus. <gasps> we'll tail him, Gaius. You keep an eye out for suspicious types at the city gate. One final thing. If the Mila we know had to die to fulfill her duty, you should know she wouldn't hesitate for a moment. So what? I don't even know what my duty is anymore.
Why can't they ever make this easy? There he is! Hey! Let's keep it up! Bye-bye! Hey, don't get ahead of us! Marcus, buddy. Thought I told you to ditch Exodus and fly right. I... I'm sorry. So you still roll with those guys? Maybe. As what, wimpy cowboy? In what world is this guy a terrorist? Yeah, he's harmless. Just hangs out with the wrong crowd, that's all. Whenever the plan calls for a disposable stooge, he's their guy. Ugh, oh, you're right. I got played as usual. What do you mean? Well, I heard a transmission from the main group. The Exodus guys in town are for show. The real action's out there. Where? On that ship, the ESS Paloon. That's where Chancellor Marcia is. You're ambushing the Chancellor of Olympias? Oh boy. We better tell Gaius about this. It's too late. Exodus agents are on board posing as crew members. They should have struck by now. You dumbasses! Chancellor Marcia is a moderate. She opposed the Otherworld Reactor Plan. Meanwhile, lots of other politicians are yelling for Olympias to put the screws to Riza Maxia. If you guys take out the Chancellor, the peace process dies with her. I didn't make the damn plan. Look, there's no saving her. Exodus has definitely got the upper hand here. Not for long. They're not wasting the time Mila gave us. I brought Gaius up to speed. All right, it's time to board this ship. Are you sure? It looks like we've got a new do-gooder in town. Silly dude, I could have told you that. Should have piped up. But you know, this won't fix all the problems between Riza Maxia and Olympias. Not by a long shot. I mean, if we stuck our heads in the sand on this, nobody would be the wiser. No, I guess I'm not. Can't blame a guy for trying though, right? Oh, bad Alvin, go to your room! Hey, if you're gonna whine like a spoiled little brat, I'm gonna lecture you like what? That makes a weird kind of sense. All right, Alvin, put on your big boy pants. Marcus, get us a barge, man, hop to it. What, why me? And thanks for agreeing to be our decoy while we board the Paloon. Decoy? But I didn't agree to nothing. Well, if you're gonna be like that, might as well hand you to the cops. Wait. Okay, okay. I'll do it. Atta boy. Way to be a team player. Uh, you treat me worse than Exodus does. And those guys are a bunch of terrorists. You need better friends. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I'm Maxwell, remember? <laughs>